has caught wind of the situation here. I suppose it was inevitable despite my efforts. That's why it's important we act quickly, decisively. They'll try to take this out of our hands, Morgan. again how the decompression happened it was very sudden i don't know the specifics but i had to act morgan hope you don't mind i was using your workstation i found the right materials for the glue gun as well was able to make several canisters i also found some food on the way up left it on the desk don't worry they're alien food i checked them no twitching to be sure i let igwe sample them first pardon me I'm joking, Igwe. I wouldn't willingly expose you to aliens. Or anyone else. That would be... inhuman. Thank you. It's a strange feeling. I hold Lightner's gift to the world in my hands. He will live on. I wish my wife could have heard him play again. That was brave of you, to recover the connectomes for me. I... I appreciate it. I appreciate all you and Transtar have done for me. I never told you why I altered my medical records. I know you were so sure when you were lecturing me, Morgan saying I was selfish and... My father, he was imprisoned for questioning the Soviet intervention in India. Many prisoners are lost in Siberian labor camps, but my father vanished. The only thing I knew for certain was Transtar was recruiting volunteers from those labor camps. I came here because of you and Alex and your experiments. To find him, and now I know he was here. I noticed on your computer. You found a set of names and ID numbers from Psychotronics, from Dr. Gallegos. The Russian volunteers were never referenced by name, but I was able to match an ID to my father. 
We can pull up his records. Archive experiment logs. I've already asked a great deal of you, but if you could find that archive in deep storage, I'll finally know what happened to my father. His name was Yuri Andronov. V01065532. Afternoon, Talos. Lunch is served in the cafeteria from 12 to 2 p.m. Please refer to the weekly upgrade for today's menu. breakdown off his computer. The last copy is hidden in his office. I'm not going back. You'll have to get it yourself. A C B A C. Good luck. Scanning target, no aliens.
Microgravity detected. I've been thinking about the video Alex showed you. Your brother believes that version of you is the true Morgan. But why? Just because it came first? If someone had made you, then I suppose your truest self would be the one that fulfills whatever purpose your maker intended. I know who made me, and why. Did someone make you, Morgan? Were you made for something? If not, you'll have to invent your own purpose, or have none at all. Strangely, of all the things I know about you, I don't know what you believe. You have to decide, Morgan. Who are you? Suit integrity damaged.
Fascinating. It's holding. Of all their victims, your hunch was on the right track. It's a kind of neural structure. Synaptic like activity up and down the length of it, like it's communicating. Just one more to go. I knew you could handle this. Our father warned me not to stake so much of the company's future on your ideas. I was right to ignore him. We're a good team, Morgan. I can't find that open airlock. I think there's something following me. It's... I keep hearing it. It's... It doesn't make any sense. It's, it's just in my head. Ay, Mateo. David, I love you both. Mom, I'm sorry. I know you were just trying to protect me. I love you so much. No, nothing that interferes with memory formation. Search complete. Excellent work. All that's left is integrating the data after you upload it. Hard to tell from just a scan summary, but... Wait. What is... There's some kind of neural tripwire built into the coral. Christ. Morgan, get back to my office. We have to get your data uploaded now. Hurry. Here's my terminal to upload the data. I'll get it integrated into the fabrication plan for the new null wave device as fast as possible. And be careful. The Typhoon will begin to sense our intent to harm the Coral. They're gonna come after you. I left something for you on my desk that should help. Star Board of Directors has authorized me to take full command of Talos One, effective immediately. All employees must now report to the shuttle bay for evacuation. Those of you unable to comply, transmit an SOS and my team of rescue operators will locate you. One last thing. Alex and Morgan and you have been relieved of their positions. Do not consent to their requests or assist them in any way. Null out. Well locked out. 
It's Dahl. He already has his hooks into every major system aboard Telos One. I have to admit, I'm disappointed with our parents. I knew that they had a contingency in place, but a small foolish part of me believed they wouldn't use him against their own flesh and blood. Regardless, we're not getting this coral data through until we do something about it. I don't like it, but you're gonna have to get into his command shuttle. See if you can locate his access point and cut him off. Morgan, Dahl will know you're coming. All Transtar personnel are outfitted with tracking bracelets. I have no doubt his operators are already on their way to rescue you. Those bracelets are issued and removed in deep storage. Worth investigating if you want to fly under the radar. Morgan. This is Igwe. I stepped out for a moment. Miss Ilyushin's father, Andronov. Osmonot. He was here. I know he was. I'm sure there are logs, records in deep storage, but... Morgan, you know what happened to him already. You've simply forgotten what you did. Miss Ilyushin... She may not understand. Do what you must. But if the records are gone, or happen to be destroyed due to the station damage, it would be for the best. Initiating test procedure 29, variant C. Morgan, I heard the announcement. No, no, I will not give you up. You are there for me, I am here for you. If you'd indulge me, I have a proposal that could get us off Talos 1 without any more bloodshed. Just... Don't harm Dahl until we've had a chance to speak in person. I promised I would see her again. I signed your papers. <sighs> Let's stay focused, everyone. You are a family. You must hate them very much to do this. I hear it in your voices. Track his vitals. 32 is showing signs of distress. Elevated cortisol, heart rate, perspiration. Nothing in the red yet. Look at me. Look at the man you're killing. Mimic is in the tube. Permission to release? Morgan? What you do kills us both. Release. Mm -hmm. ah, 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 Typhoon Kakoblasmi ah, specimen is in the chamber ah, with subject 32. Ah, 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 subject, uh... Coming in. Downloading now. 
Morgan, thank you. Thank you so much. I cannot... I cannot believe it. I'll wait for you to come back before I listen to it. Be careful, Morgan. Your brother, he likes a microphone. A spotlight. He can't resist. Even though he's hiding. And you are running around like a nervous rat. I hear you. Chewing the wires and shitting in the walls. Are you trying to fix the mess you've made? Or just get away? I pride myself in being prepared for the worst. But this... This is truly a masterpiece. You should be proud. Thank <laughs> you. 